lot of people. You're a champ, aren't you? Look at this guy. Thanks for getting my truck back. Hey, say, can I set you up with the toaster? I think I'm all right. Adi called me a bit ago. Spent 20 minutes chewing my behind all the pieces. Told me he wanted to meet me at um, Mama Rigetti's Bakery, wherever that is. Don't worry. Won't take me long to find it. I'm glad you're going after him. No one raises his voice at Grand Purdue, but uh, the nerve. Word of the wise, don't get in bed with mobsters. You'll live longer. job and find him. Got one of us. Holy fuck, this guy's. What? That's your job, not mine. Come to some sort of arrangement and work together. What do you think, Hardy? Okay, I guess you and me can work something out. That's what I like to hear. Can you send some guys to South Downs? Help keep it in our hands. Good deal. You're making the right call, no question about it. I'm of two minds when it comes to Lincoln's legacy. On the one hand, he was a, 
a brutal criminal who killed God knows how many people, a new breed of mobster, a prototype for criminals to come. Someone like that doesn't deserve the position history has afforded him. He should be forgotten, erased. But I also understand that Lincoln had a significant impact on the Italian mob in this city. He did what the Bureau wouldn't or couldn't do. He finished them. Hey, Lincoln, checking the place out. Marcano had a pretty good operation going here, but we're working on putting it to shame. 